tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make a meta ball animation in Bry 7. First of all, you simply select one of these little meta balls. I'm going to enlarge it. I'm just going to delete the surface layer here and put some water in for a reflection. Alright, let's texture it. To texture the meta ball, you click on the triangle next to edit. And I'm going to choose, let's have a look, etched steel. Yeah, etched steel. Click the tick to apply. Click the render. Let's have a quick preview, see what it looks like. Okay. Now if you copy and paste, control C, control V, these meta balls, they can bond. Look at the preview up here in the top left hand corner. As I move it closer, it the meta balls want to bond together. You go the bond, it looks like one object. Let's do an animation of that happening. So to animate this, make sure auto key is on down here, bottom right hand corner, click on the little arrow. If you can't see these timeline tools, click on this little sphere icon and click here again. And simply drag time, let's drag time one second. We're looking at 24 frames a second. Let's move both these meta balls in. Let's drag time again and move them out again. And drag time one more time and move them in. Let's preview that by clicking down here on the preview. Look in the top left, top left hand corner to preview the animation. They're coming together and then they'll go apart and they'll come together again. Well my computer seems to have frozen. Oh it's come back alive. Alright, so let's press escape. Now to render this fully Bring time back to 1. You can see the animation there in wireframe mode. File, render animation, Alt Shift R will allow you to render the animation. You can edit the quality. I usually use full frames uncompressed and you can set the file location. And then you simply just press the tick and it will render all the frames which could take up to 15-20 minutes for a 2-3 to three second animation with water. So that's how you make a simple meta blob, meta ball animation in Bryce 7.